Ah, the beautiful world of the Going Green DLC in Prison Architects, where making money with prison is optional. Why is it optional? Well, you could just use green power and make money forever and never build a prison. Pretty simple. First off, we're gonna create a new one. Then, very important, you want to turn on the weather, even if it's legacy, that's totally fine. Then, under the wardens, you want to choose the ecologist. The ecologist is going to increase the power output and double the value of exported energy. After this, you can set your starting rate a little more if you need. Plot's fine. And then we hit play. Instantly close the intake. And now, we are going to start with quick building two offices. Speed that up, and while they are building that, I am also going to start putting down a transformer and a power export meter. Now as the office has been built, we are going to hire the warden. This guy is going to be a handy boy. Now the only thing we're going to have this guy research is going to be finance. The reason we're going to do this is for the tax relief. It's just kind of neat to have. Next up, we're going to click on the utilities and we're going to install a few solar panels. We're going to install three at the beginning and we're going to add a two batteries here and we're gonna have them build it do not forget to connect this up to the transformer or else you will not get your money now that these have been built we have actually finished or started with one of the green energy goals these goals allow you to get a ton more money from your energy goal two is not that difficult neither is goal three or four they just require you to sit here and look at your beautiful installation of green power now we're going to install some of these that takes off another one and the solar wind hybrids the solar wind hybrids actually generate at any time of the day the wind turbines have debuffs but that's okay the solar panels do not but they do not work during the day so these are just a nice little mix to have everything now as you can see the meter is filling up and at midnight exactly in two hours it's going to sell and give us some of that delicious money we can also take two grants one of them is ego friendly and the other is green machine which will instantly finish because we already did that and green machine just requires you to install one of each green power source super easy you can do it now these this is nicely generating we're actually going to build another setup more setups means more energy is being exported means more money don't forget to hook it up we do not have a lot of money left that's a bit of an oopsie but we'll get it back we just need to let this sit and export our, our energy for us and we're going to get that glorious cash now you can see these are capping out a thousand dollars probably wondering how come? That's a green energy goal. If we finish this one, we will unlock the next one, which will upgrade the capacity again and again until we just never stop. Now we're going to get every single goal here, apart from six, because that requires to, uh, <laughs> to actually run a prison. We're not going to do that. This is not like a prison game, though, is it? Now you can see we have full batteries, meaning we are wasting power install more although we don't have a lot of money we will have money soon you do want to make sure that these are not full and you're not storing any more especially once your uh, capacity is maxed because then you're just wasting money can't have that there we go some more delicious money meaning we can install more batteries now once you've done this for long enough you're actually gonna start making a little more than this amount of money Let's hop to a prison I pre-made. Now, as you can see in this delicious prison, we are making $16,000 a day. That's 17,000 in exports. How are we doing this? Now, once, you, as you can see, we have a lot of power being generated. And if you go to the goals, once you get goal seven, the effects, the negative effects of weather will be halved and the positives will be doubled, which is already massive for income. You can also see that goal nine, fully charged on the batteries, is going to double the output of every single green power source, meaning we are generating a lot of power. If you click on, if you hover over the generators or the exports, you can see we are barely in the day and we are already exporting about 10 grand now integrating a big money source like this into a prison isn't that difficult as you can see in this nice little prison we have some green power sources also with batteries fully filling up our expert meter is exporting three thousand dollars if we go to the in the exports we have power export two thousand from the previous day this day it's going to be more. we could even add some more these boys and we just sold 3,000 in power exports. So you could have this running as your main power source. And then as well as your main money source. Which is just double the fun, isn't it? Now here in the workshop, there's also a program called Solar Panel Development. It's just nice. It comes with the DLC. You could do it. You, you don't have to. It'll just re it'll just make sure the prisoners are reformed a bit better, which means they won't come back to your prison and you won't be fined. That's a positive. Not the bank balance of this prison, but more reform. This prison isn't using primitive power at the moment. That's kind of sad. If you want to see me build this prison, there's a video here where I build a prison starting with no money. And if you want me to actually add potential money-making 
power in this prison. Make sure to leave a comment and like the video so I can make a beast of a power generator and a money generator from this prison.